Oh, what? Hell yeah. Heck yeah. I'm pretty sure that one's fine. I'm pretty sure you're allowed to say hell on commentary. Yeah. We're okay to say that one. Or not. <laughs> anyway, anyway. Uh, okay. What the? This is weird. You're telling me he can just side B out of everything? Everything. He can do it. He can do it out of Diddy Up Smash. <laughs> okay. He can do it out of things that are conf that are confirmed. That's actually insane. Yeah. But it, in on, in all honesty, sometimes I feel like it's not worth it because I feel it's like probably you still, not. If you, you still straight, take you the same damage as if you did it or not, I feel like it's not all the time, but in most situations. All right, but nonetheless, we have two players who are very proficient with both of their characters. Um, so far. I, I, it's hard to understand this man. He was saying he wanted to Ooh. go. He wanted to solo main Cloud for a while, but he has stuck with Luigi ever since he told me that. So, <laughs> see, that's what I'm talking about. I, I mean, Greninja mains habitually do that, but I feel like it's especially helpful in this matchup to go for those hydro pumps while he's off stage. Well, I don't, I don't think it actually even pushes back Luigi's up B, does it? His up B? Yeah. If I mean, if he's gonna, if he's sweet spot, if he's gonna sweet spot. I don't think it's really going to do anything, is it? Yeah, I mean, uh, Sofa's really proficient at sweet spotting the ledge. But if he does, if he doesn't sweet spot, it'll probably yeah, push him Yes, away. it will probably it will cause problems. And that's what I'm saying is that no one's perfect, so Sofa could eventually miss that sweet spot. All right, yeah, you got to be careful with those. Those those do uh, go through the ledge, fully charged, I believe, or even mostly charged, maybe. Just playing the game, uh, play the spacing game. Uh, it's kind of shocking to see Sofa running away. I know he he probably needs time just to collect himself. But uh, so due to Luigi's really tough time approaching, uh, it's just going to put, I feel like it's just putting himself in a worse spot. Oh, goes for the jab up B. Oh, oh but Luigi's weird. Gets the weight, bad hitbox. Yeah. And he goes for another up smash. Yeah, uh, BT Mac is uh, not afraid to do. Nothing. Oh, oh! <laughs> uh, Stops it with the water shuriken. You knew Sofa wanted that at that exact moment, too. Yeah, BT is not afraid to play his lead, you know, like, yeah. which I don't blame him. He's at a great, great lead right now. Yeah, and Ooh, that's going to do it. Catches okay. Sofa slipping with the Shadow Sneak, baby. I think that's what it's called. Yeah, Shadow Sneak. <laughs> uh, and then Luigi's slippery, like, buttery shoes don't help at all either. Goes for an air, but doesn't quite get anything off of it. Man, this is really funny for me to watch because, like, I have I've, no idea what to say. I've <laughs> been I've been in the indie scene for a very long time, and like back in the day, Sofa was like the number two. He was a god; no one could touch him. And BT and like a lot of the NG guys, we were like scrubs. And they, Sofa <laughs> would just like he would just punch on us, man. And now the tides have turned. Finish the set, okay? The tides have turned, and now BT is a proficient enough player to keep up with a lot of yeah. top indie players. Oh. What's going on here? Uh oh, R reverse. Yeah. Uh, what was that? Or like a reverse up tilt into up air? Up that air. was really that good. Was sick. That second stock was very clean for BT Mac coming out. Yeah, a two stock, two stock game one. BT Mac. Mm. Oh, that's why. Right, looks like we. This is gonna be our last set on commentary before we gotta go. Yep, you gotta play in pools, baby. Pool four. I guess that's really why I came here at the end of the day. So. <laughs> Look at that Mario skin. You mean the Il Piantissimo one? <laughs> and the Bayonetta skin. What's up, Jake? Is Let's go, Purdue. Uh, are we getting Switch? a Switch? Oh. DDD! <laughs> <laughs> so full, why do you do this to me? I hate you so much. Oh No! Oh. Stop! Stop Where being a jerk, going? Sofa. Just pick Luigi. She... D D D. Spooks is getting. Yeah, tilted. we have we have a specific no mashing out the character select screen rule going on, and uh, that's funny. I I mash every time I'm so on stream. Sofa just violated it, and now BT Max on the train apparently. Great. Sofa taking his time. He's I think he's a little lost on who he should play. Just go back to Luigi, man. My I don't know, man. He got two stock. He has other characters. Cracking. I can understand him switching. He got he got two stock. So like, if he is gonna switch, it better not be to DDD. And he's just going back to Luigi. Uh, I told you Luigi. that's what he was gonna do. I'm surprised no cloud. 
his cloud, it's not, he doesn't like his cloud yet. He's not confident in it. At least, at least that's what I understand he, he told me. Going back to Smashville, uh, fireball to the wrong direction. That's not going to help any. Taking some sweet damage from that uh, Cyclone. Mm -hmm. Let's see if uh, Sofa can fix what he did last game. Tries to get a grab off it. <laughs> Both the jab, jab is so direction. stupid. Luigi's jab has that weird, has an abnormally large hitbox behind him. Even jab two has the same principle, so like it's really weird. Luigi's jab is actually incredible. It's a good move. It's it's just so good at covering stuff. And I have no idea to explain how. I'm glad to see Sofa doing more off of down throw than what he used to, at least from when I used to commentate his sets. It's been a long while, though, since I've done that, so probably shouldn't be saying too much on it. I've seen. I've also seen Sofa throwing out very little up smash. Maybe because he has trouble getting in, but that's. He tells me that the, it's stronger than Mario's. So you wish Luigi had better movement so he could utilize it like that. <laughs> yeah, Luigi's. I feel like Luigi's movement is much more uh, restricted than Mario's. Yeah. Which is where the problem lies, unfortunately. It's kind of like Game and Watch, honestly. Game and Watch definitely has like pretty much the best up smash in this game, but his movement is so bad that. It, can't be helped. Yeah, one more of those might do it, honestly. Yeah, with that little bit of rage, maybe. Yeah. But it's probably stale now, so I doubt it. Yeah, it's, it's so hard to factor in which is more important, rage or staling. Ow. Ooh, that hurt. <laughs> Ooh, Ooh, another Shadow Sneak clips him, and that's going to do it, unfortunately. Dang. Let's see if Sofa has an answer for BT. Yeah, well, he's going to have to find it out. F he's going to have to find an answer quickly. I agree. Oh, he goes for the – gets an up, up smash. smash? Yep. He double up smash, too. <laughs> he missed the first one, and then BT down air. He's just aired. like, screw it. Well, BT uh, down air didn't miss. So yeah, he was in yeah that's, that's, a pretty, that's a pretty bad whiff, honestly. Greninja's down air is a really good move to like – because it's so good on shield since you just bounce right off of it. Yeah. Um, but if you miss it, you're yeah. kind of in. You, you're in a, if you're in a pretty life. good position. Yeah, to get bad news bears. Bad news bears. I haven't said that one in years. I know, I haven't heard that in a while. Okay, getting a good conversion off the down, down air there. This is looking pretty good for BT. Mm -hmm. Ooh, <coughs> yikes. Linear recovery almost. But a cycle good could take Gib could take it, you know? Like yeah, that's Luigi. One for you. bad interaction off stage and I thought he was gonna go for the up B because he loves that setup so much, his jab up B. Another up smash. Now this is completely doable for Luigi. Yeah, he's starting to get into scary percent ranges though. Oh, oh. was that supposed to be a jab reset read or something? Because I know Luigi's jab doesn't lock, but his fireball does. So this is now looking this is pretty doable for Sofa like King, honestly. Completely doable. Uh, that was Up definitely. smash will kill. Oh, oh, not quite. Not yet. I am <laughs> I'm a stupid idiot. No, it's fine. I, now it will. I think even with staling in mind, that'll probably still do it. You see, yeah. he's going for it. You're yeah, right. yeah, yeah. You're right. You were right. <laughs> what, a good, what a good comeback from Sofa yeah, King there. Yeah, good Sofa. All right, let's hey, go Purdue-ish. He's not in Purdue, but he attended the Purdue scene, so let's go Purdue-ish. Thanks. <laughs> Good mental fortitude from uh, Sofa. Mm -hmm. He was yeah. he was down by a lot, and he brought yeah. it completely back. I know back. Sofa it just gets a little tilted by his mentality sometimes. So BT's good to see him stand composed and keeping up with it. Completely determined. Mm -hmm. BT looks after so that determined. first game. I would be too. Yeah, me too. Okay, using his shadow sneak to escape those attacks once more. Fire versus water, you would think the water shurikens would just go right through it. Oh, man, what if that jab locked? Uh, I don't really think there's much he can do off of it, unfortunately. Like, Greninja has insane, like, jab lock strings, but, like, you have to be so proficient with them, and the position he was at just didn't accommodate for that at and all. And they're really situational. Yeah. So, like, I mean, there's most jab locks are. And, and Luigi's know. in that weird weight class where a lot of those, like, combos that generally work on characters, yeah. he just kind of falls out of them. Maybe could have upbeat off of that missed Ooh. down air. I see BT Max just really trying to get mileage out of those shurikens, but I think Sofa King's starting to catch on to BT Max game here. I agree. And he's going to need to start approaching more because Greninja's offense is. Oh. Ooh, that was tricky. No, Sofa. No. Oh, no, Don't BT get Max. Punished. No. He could have killed him off that. Uh, 
Looks like one of the wave pools is missing three people. <laughs> I'll join that one. Which pool? Yeah, please sign me up. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so that's. Yeah, Sofa King's gonna need to get in. I know it's hard with a, with a much better projectile than his fireball. You know, BT needs to. So, <laughs> I feel like BT could. Every time BT goes for that down throw, fair. That was an up B attempt right there. He doesn't wait for an air dodge, and so far air dodges every time. Yeah, if he just if he like if he if he waited, I feel like I he think could, he, he I think he definitely it. could have gotten one. Yeah, using those water shurikens just to safely keep Luigi at bay. Is that gonna do it? Oh no, no but not quiet. If he's not careful. Wow, this is insanely close. Right? I love Greninja spot dodge. He just disappears for a sec. Same for Mewtwo. Dead. Back throw should do it. Yep. Yeah. Okay. That's a back throw. Back throw with rage at one. 40 <laughs> will tend to do it with most characters. All right, yeah, he's escaping. He's just trying to mitigate that damage so he can get back into a easier territory, which might not be bad for Sofa at this point. I mean, you don't want to just lose a stock lead. There you go again. See, yeah, you yeah know you're right. You're right. Yeah, I think you, you should just wait. Uh, but, you know, like nobody plays perfectly, as I said before. Yeah, and no, nerves yeah. are probably getting to him right now. But nonetheless, he's still got to kill off with that forward air. That's just something that we can say. Yeah, as we can say. As con yeah, yeah, we're just like, oh, look, here's a mistake he could be doing better. Which always makes me feel kind of bad because if I were up here playing Greninja, I wouldn't know what the heck to do. <laughs> yeah, I, 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 I like the input, though. If you're yeah, no, yeah, I know. It's not but meant to be I, rude. I don't know. It's just why I always like feel bad about commentary sometimes because I'm like, wait, why am I saying this like I could do it better? Yeah. But nonetheless, we have a, <laughs> we have a big lead coming out from Sofa now. Uh, BT Mac, of course, ha was really solid that game one, but now it's looking like. It's looking really rough. For looking BT. kind of a rough uphill battle for Sofa. Or for, for BT, BT, excuse me. Yeah, Sofa, Sofa can comfortably play pretty well here at this point. He just needs to, you know, not, not get too gr greedy, especially since his recovery is, you know, on the more predictable spectrum. I think an up smash would take it. I know, I don't think so. You don't think so? Uh, he has no rage. Like, if he just had a bit more rage, even, like, this, honestly, that, this will do it. Maybe. Ooh. Oh, if he got that last one, I think that would have killed, honestly. Okay, see, now we're in the scary spot where Luigi's not not having stage control. He wants to hurry up and get back in the middle of that stage. Oh. So Luigi would have a lot better time punishing. Oh, now this is completely okay, doable yeah, for BT. This, is, this became really close. But Interesting counter. You'll notice that uh, there was one point there when uh, BT Mac uh, forward smashed on Luigi's shield, but because of his weird sliding mechanic, uh, he has a hard time punishing bad op options that are normally unsafe yeah. on, on shield, he which really may does. make up for which. Oh, oh that's going to do it. Oh, no. Good stuff to Sofa King. Oh, man. Sofa caught BT slipping, dude. <laughs> he got that was, slipping. That, that, BT Mac had me had me on the edge of my seat there, though, with that, with that run back on that last stock there. Yeah, I agree. But uh, for now, uh, Prod and I are called to our pools, and I also